Hi, Lauren. Inside Creative Kids here, you will find a lot of happy smiles. You'll find plenty of laughter. You'll find little children uh, with big hearts. But on the outside, this sign here that reads Learning Center, it will soon be gone because the property owner here says they have 30 days to vacate. It was October 31st, and the staff at Creative Kids in Durham got a knock at the door and this letter from their landlord giving them 30 days to vacate. They're saying all this information that went so fast, and she's like, wait a minute, like, what, is, what are you even saying? These bright smiles and laughter have been a home away from home for children for the past five years, but in a matter of weeks, that will quickly come to an end in this space as they know it. I invested everything in this place, everything, even just the stuff you see here. I thought we could never be touched, and bam, Tuesday comes, and oh my God, what, are we, what 30 days? What are, we, what are we doing? Brenda Kithcart runs Creative Kids as a drop-in center with her mother-in-law, Darletta. My baby girl. The two have poured so much money, soul, and energy into this center, and it shows. My friends say I must be crazy to call me superwoman because I'm always moving, but I tell them I don't have a choice. And what makes their exit from their Miami Boulevard location somewhat bitter is the 30-day notice they were given. Brenda and her team feel if the property owner knew the building and land would be sold, more of a heads up should have been given. It's just really a slap in the face when you get that and you're smiling. I'm being so kind. She sees the work I'm putting in here, the upgrades we're putting in here. But the silver lining is wrapped in gratitude. They see this as an opportunity and prelude to a prayer for a larger space to expand business and serve more families. We're just looking for greater. We're really looking for greater things to happen. At the end of the day, we know we have to leave. So let me get the truck and tell these men, these dads, come help us with this move. You can't do anything else. We need y'all to just, I'll give you a football game and some wings if you need it. But I just need some help. Yeah, we actually saw some of those parents, some of those dads come up earlier today to pick up their children. They are hopeful, they're prayerful that they're able to find something they have until the end of this month uh, to leave this place. If you'd like to help, we have a way for how you can do so. Just look for this story right now on our website. We're live in Durham tonight. Dewan Hogarth, ABC 11 Eyewitness News. You never know who sees this story tonight, Dewan. Help might come quickly. Let's hope so. Thank you.